these are the things that I like about this vehicle 2024 Honda CRV is the side mirrors they're black they have one touch window up and down for each of these you just tap them one time up or down and they go up and down the sun visor it extends out and there's an arm for it as well but sometimes if you put a towel here the you could have more shade. I also like the, the infotainment system. It has a back button on it. 12 volt, 180 max. It has heated seats on this vehicle. It doesn't have cool seats. The exterior lights, they're pretty good. They're, they're LEDs, as well as the exterior lights as well. I like the stitching. It's pretty nice. It'll probably fit in the sun over time. I like that it has a push start feature. I like the mats. I like that it has these controls. It has the one, two setting for your seat position. The seat comes in and out. This vehicle has brake hold, where if you press on the brakes, then it'll stick without you having to put your foot on the brake pedal. The mats have a mat lock only on the driver's side. It's pretty spacious in general when you're in this vehicle. Interior lights, visibility is pretty good. When you're driving, you don't necessarily have too many blind spots. The ride quality is decent for this vehicle and the badging looks good. I like the grill. What I don't like about this car is you always have to turn this on every time you turn the car on. The lane keep assist, it doesn't stay on. The lug nuts, they're not black, but you could buy them if you want. But it does give good contrast to, to have black and then the silver. The hubcap, it's not black. It would look better if it was blacked out. I don't necessarily like this plastic that's around the car. It would be better if it was just painted. The interior, this one isn't black. This one, it's not black, it's silver. The steering wheel logo, it's not black. It would be nicer if it was black. This phone charger, it's pretty useless because it charges real slow and it's pretty basic, but I guess it's here for, to encourage the driver not to be using or be on their phone. Android Auto, it doesn't always work. Sometimes the screen, it freezes out and you can't use it. Sometimes the wireless, it's not connecting. Even if you use the wire, sometimes it doesn't connect on. It would be better if, if this was a Type-C, but it's a USB A or B. This vehicle, it didn't come with a cargo cover. You could buy this on Amazon for about a hundred bucks. It doesn't come with a spare because your hybrid battery is there. It comes with this kit and then this is for the gas tank. You have your little spaces here. These spaces. It would be interesting if there was a cover here. Same thing as here. This is kind of small. That space. The acceleration is slow for this car. You'd be getting about 36 mpg. It's heavy. And for this badge it wasn't black. And these badges they weren't black either. And it would, it would have been better if there was a clear bra. A partial clear bra for these pieces. Because this is my hood after 10,000 miles. Your vehicle, it's not going to be perfect, right? That you would have these little dings and dents. Basic wear and tear. Alright, let me know what you guys think about this vehicle and what are likes and dislikes that you have for your own vehicle.